Welcome to the largest outdoor art exhibition in the country. For almost half a century, this annual event here at Nathan Phillips Square has given millions of art lovers a fresh air alternative to enjoy and purchase works of art. These are mousetrap paintings. Um, they do look abstract, but they are based on photographs uh, of, of fire scenes in, in the Okanagan that I've pixelated into blocks of color. This piece is called I Make. It's sort of a play on printmaking. It, it's not a traditional medium uh, or, or printmaking. It's using uh, the typewriter, but it's, it's uh, using font, text, print. This one here just came back from the framers yesterday. It's called Saraswati after the name of this figure, this statue here, which is the Hindu goddess of learning, education, which means, uh, in this instance, literature, music, and art, which is right up my alley. So I've kind of adopted Saraswati as my, my personal Hindu uh, deity. This is part of a series called As Above, So Below, which to me has great meaning, and I hope that conveys uh, it to, to the viewer. The other two pieces, The Wedding Couple, and again, another piece from that wonderful Hindu temple complex are flanking this centerpiece, which is an image from Turkey. And um, it's a combination of images, obviously, because the man and the woman are husband and wife, and they're sesame seed farmers. And they were harvesting their crop at the time that I was passing through. So there we are, but I've put them into the Hagia Sophia, and it's truly one of the most beautiful buildings I've ever had the pleasure to be in. For more information on the Toronto Outdoor Art Exhibition, simply log on to the website below. Here at Nathan Phillips Square in downtown Toronto, I'm Darren Maharaj for Zoomer News.